Hi folks, I'm Vincent Stewa, I'm going to play the Memory of Elder Rim, a game by Lenella Games. And as we've got quite a significant update, I'm going to try to do something. I'm going to go, we're going to climb the mountain and we're going to try to reach the castle, which was an area which was pretty empty before. I would very much like to see what we can find there now. So, we've got also, I think, a new part of the main quest which is in the game, but I will just put that apart for now. And we're just going to explore a bit the world and see what has changed. So let's just maybe make a, a brief stop at the village so we can see if there is anything different and then we'll just head for the castle because it's a very important part of the world it is not on a mountain for nothing, look at this thing, it's beautiful uh, I'm pretty sure we won't be able to read that, but we'll see Alright, let's see This village is still very, very beautiful and I believe we've got a new launcher as well to tweak a bit um, the graphic possibilities of the game. Look at that! Isn't it wonderful? Oh, it seems to be. I don't remember this little rock in the middle here. This little wall. And it feels like the village has just changed very sub subtle, subtly. It's very. You know, there is. I think there is more, more textures on these seems to be to have a little bit more character here. Oh, and look at that. This is very different here. It was not the case. Before we were just entering a little building and now we are climbing a little mountain. And there is even a little bridge over there. So cool. Let's keep climbing. We'll get a beautiful view on the village here. And here it is. This is the house which was down there, there was no no hill to claim nothing, and now it's just so cool. So I believe this is a magician which is living here. Vilsam. So let's talk to him. And I think he's going to explain me all the magic work, the different elements and stuff. It's not going to be useful for now. Okay, so let's just see if we can just... Oh, I missed it can get a bit of a view before we go. I'll just use the little area. Oh, there is even some guy which is just over there, a dress. They are still looking a bit alike, but I believe this is going to be resolved at some point. And yes, I love this thing. Look at that. We can even just gaze a bit at the rest of this place. Let's just see if we can get them all, all the mount around. It does not really feel safe to make a castle here, but it's obviously difficult to, to attack. Alright, look at the, at the mills, and we can see the little... Ah, we cannot. We cannot see the little fishing out we were in at the beginning. But there is obviously something here. What do we have in there? Such big doors and stuff. Oh, <laughs> it looked like bigger from afar, but now it is cool nonetheless. Look at a little balcony here, which is going to allow us for sure to just peek a bit at the bay. Oh, and we can see something over there. So these are boats, I think these are boats of the invader. We're going to see plenty of new stuff, because we should be able to see it from here, but there is a camp over there. Maybe we can't. So, just in front of the castle, there is a camp of invaders, and now there is boats. So it seems pretty cool. We're going to check that, and we can see now there is a little village here, and these mills—they were not there. So these are new also. It took me a time to realize that, but these are new. Okay, it seems to me that the map is very, very different. Let's just check if there is anything of interest in there. Another room, pretty nice. It's cozy. Okay, let's get out of here. I'm going to check this little house and we are going to go. Alright, what? Oh, nice. Look at this. And... That's a bit high, I'm not going to jump. 
<laughs> there is no chance for me to survive this. I had pretty good equipment the last time I've been playing, but I don't even know if it's going to be good enough because maybe things have been changed. Not only in the um, in the way the landscape is. Hopefully it will be enough, but maybe I, I would I could be getting killed and, and stuff like that. We'll see if we're lucky or not. So let's just advance. I could explore the other house of this village, but I feel like maybe it's not going to be as interesting as going out for a little a little walk. I'm just going to make a brief stop at the at the trader. See, oh, what is that? I should definitely take a, a brief stop here as well. <laughs> I'm not going to, to get out of the village if I'm continuing like that. Let's just take a look. Okay, so it's a little bit. It's very cool. In the a bit in the mountain like that. Oh, I almost hold. Whatever's there. A little island with a bridge. Come on, guys! This is so beautiful. I, I'm never going to get out of this village. <laughs> I need to check that. There is no way I'm going to live without che checking that. I love these buildings. These are frankly amazing. Okay, let's go back here. I'm pretty sure this is not for nothing that this is here. Do I need to be careful with the uh, with the planks? That seems to be alright. And what do we have in there? Do we have enemies or anything like here? So there's a little. It could be I don't know the house of the sorcerer or or a witch or something. It's a bit far from anything. And nope, there is nothing in there. But I like it. I'm pretty sure if you were to, I don't know, to buy a bit of land in this game. Oh, look at that. Okay, who is that? The mage, probably. Yeah, it's definitely a mage. So if you were able to, I don't know, purchase a bit of land and build something, I would definitely build it here. It's, it's not that big, but it seems to be absolutely amazing. And I'm pretty sure when the sun is going to rise. It's just going to be the best place to look at it. So let's try to find the, the bridge again. Eh, hey, look at that! There is even a little uh, bit of flower over there. Nice. Let's keep exploring. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's try to do what we were saying for once. I'm going to hit the match and then go. Oh, a little bridge has been destroyed here. Um, absolutely speechless in front of these waves and stuff. Look at look at the water. Ah, let's go. Usually I'm not really a sucker for graphism, I'm much more interested in gameplay, but there is so much ambience here. Even just going around seems to be worth it. So it's Belsar, I think. I don't remember oh, what was the name of the, um, of the main NPC of this area. So there was somebody who was giving you quests quest and stuff. Let's take a look, because the merchant house was not that... No, we've got a, a few new things here. Let's talk to... Show me away else. And nothing on just except for the torch. Do I have any? Is it really necessary? Oh yes, it's going to be. I'm going to take the, the lantern as well, because maybe it's going to be night. I don't want to be left in the dark. It would just ruin the video. So I'm going to take both, just in case, when I would not be walking anymore. And, oh, my mistake, I don't want to kill you, sorry. And let's take a look. A few guards, seems to be a bit more alive, so... And I think maybe the... Yes, yeah, there is a lot more people, and a lot more little things around. Yes. Let's go.
I think I could stay a bit more here, but it's a road. So the main NPC, she, I think she was, and she was called my my child. So she's probably going to give me a quest and time to go on the end phone. Okay, let's go. I don't know where they're going to go, but uh, another challenge. Uh, maybe I'm not going to do the quest right now, but we'll if we were to do it on the way without noticing, maybe it would be a thing. So let's just go around. I'm probably going to attack a few enemies here because I don't want to be flanked by them. There should be somebody in the. Are they gone? We were attacked by bandit here, and I don't see them anymore. Maybe they're not going to attack from here. It's going to be a nice surprise. Alright, so it seems to be a pretty tranquil road here. And if we... Oh, here they are. It's a lot more surprising. But my sword is still making a little bit <laughs> too easy here. Oh, and let's take a look around. Do we have more buttons here? Yes, there is one over there. Nonetheless, if we were to go there, there should be... Golems, yes, yeah, they are still there. Not going to go with them again. It's going to take me a bit too much time. But we are going to go for this bandit here. Oh, which is using what? No, just uh, as for a sec, I switched with a rifle. But it's just a 200 sword. I've got also a, po a powerful attack. This was just a swift and, and quick attack. I can also use my shield to protect myself. So here is a, there's kind of a crypt in there, and there is a boss which is pretty tough in there. Most of them are skeleton around, but uh, there is a, a bad wizard or maybe a necromancer down there which is waiting for us. I'm not going to go for him right now because I feel like maybe I could get slotted and it would just make me spawn back and it would do the same road again. So let's just fight this guy. Oh, this little door is new. Let's just get this guy killed. It's a powerful attack. And this one also. They need to fall. And I really like the fact that they are just dropping all their equipment. If it, even if it's not interesting, this is a feature I really like in any game. I, I do feel like it's them when you cannot recover the weapon or the arm or somebody you just get, get down. So I'm pretty fond of this. <laughs> So let's see. We should be f fighting a knight somewhere further. So these are caves. In there, there is a few golems with a bit of loot. Be careful, there is plenty. So if you are not strong enough, you should avoid this. Okay, where's the knight? I think. Oh, there yeah, they are. Are they? So I've got the quest already. There is a little quest over there. And these guys are not bandits. They are invaders and they are waiting for me. But they won't be dangerous enough here. Beware that if you do not have good equipment, they can be very dangerous. They've got pretty cool armor, and this is a very. If you manage to kill them, this is a very good beginner equipment here. Let's just remove it. I did not show you that, but there is a little counter with this little shield bash. Oh, and look at that! This is new as well. I think the subject was something like 1 gigs and 600 MB. So, there's plenty of things for our little update here. So, hours and stuff. Let's take a look. Who lives here? Nobody for now, but maybe somebody will soon. Got squash here. Even more. And look! Yep. I'm amazed by the little sound. I didn't expect me to be doing that kind of sound. By Look at that, we're just pushing these. This is... <laughs> it seems little, but... We are not really used to be able to... to move and have the, um, the vegetation around just react to your moves. This is amazing. To and even with these, look at that. I did not notice it at first, but... Okay, amazing. I barely noticed the guy which were waiting for me. Let's go on. 
so this layout is a bit different. I'm, you know, a bit lost. Come on, just get lost here. Eh? Not going to fight you so much. Oh, there is even more. I'm going to get them all before I return to my regular walk around. It was some kind of, uh, of an ambush here. And three well done, I like it. Okay, nobody in there yet. These, this area are probably going to get full of stuff, but for now, not yet ready. I not, not, uh, did not match it, but this is a game which is still on early access, so it's by no mean affiliate product. And it will be improved over time, as usual, with many of the game, uh, of the game I'm covering. Nonetheless, the polish of this game is amazing. Okay, so let's see. I think I need to find the... Oh, look at these little roots. <laughs> they're not so little. Maybe it's not even trees. I don't know. So we need to find a way to reach the beach. So we can... I think I need to follow this road here. The setup has been changing a bit, so it's not... As I remember it. I could just jump into the water and try to... Oh, let's try to climb this. I think I, can, I probably can. Maybe I can't. <laughs> I hope I can though. Let's try again. Because maybe it was just my own failure here. If I was to just go and climb this properly, maybe I could just... Oh! The bridge is here now? Good to know. So I probably cannot climb higher, but at least I know where the bridge is. So let's just go back without falling too much. I don't know if I can fall from that high. And we're going to try to reach the right spot. So we are back on the road here. And okay, so previously this area was a friendly area. There was guard of the other faction, but now they are not any more friendly. They are enemies. Maybe the main quest is going to allow me to reconquest this area, but for now it seems to be pretty unhappy to see me here. Fortunately for me there are no match. And I could even use a... you know I could use a bit of magic here. I just use my fireball here and... oh not powerful enough but still it was fun. And what is very cool is that you know the magic is... is very different in this game. When you are you're going to use magic you are going to... oh Sorry, I did not say you. I was not ignoring you at all. Uh, so, <laughs> the magic is very different because when you are going to use the magic, let's go and use it a bit, you are going to fill some kind of, of focus bar and as you are going to do that, you are going to advance more and more from your limits and when you are going to reach your limit, your vision is going to be blurred like that. And if you keep using it, you are going to die. And it can be a bit crippling to be in that state. So you cannot really just pawn this spell. You need to... What can on here? I think I heard something. Yes, there is a bit more guards around. So you need to be careful when you are going to use magic. So that guy is... Trouble. Is a lightning. Yeah? And is not being killed right now. But now is... Oh, what kind of loot do we have here? So we've got the Great Sword, which is not as good, but interesting nonetheless. Then we've got um, a Valerian Pauldron. Is it better than mine? Yes, obviously. Uh, except... Taken back to Attica and this one... Oh, okay, let's try it. We'll change a bit the, the way my, my gear looks like. And this thing seems to be... I've got the Eldery, I don't really need the Valoran, I think. Nope, okay, nothing else is interesting. Let's just go away. This, our, this is our turf now. <laughs> need to bail. And let's go and, and reach the boats. I'm pretty curious about these. This is the first time I'm going to see boats in Memory of Eldery. And there seems to be plenty of these. Oh, look at the fort! 
it's not the same one. It seems to be a lot more sturdy and a lot more dangerous. Look at that. It was barely a camp before, now it's definitely a fort. Yes, definitely. I could just jump into the water and reach a beach. I think I'm going to be obligated to do that nonetheless. Because, or I could try to follow the walls over there. I don't know. They're probably not going to open the door for me, are they? Nope. I'm the mailman, open. Nah. Uh, let's just go and now nah, we're going to go with the water seems to be less dangerous and a bit shorter so we're going to go for the water what was that oh we need to check, check it I don't know why there would be a little plate like this if there was nothing interesting over there so let's just go and check it looked like there is crates and stuff and this is very new. It will be a good place to just take a look at the boats. Okay, there is nothing. <laughs> My mistake. Uh, we could check the, the barrels here. But there is not so much more. So here are the boats. And if I can swim with my gear, we are going to cross. I feel like, you know, my armor should be just... Be a little bit of... Um, have an issue, but oh, I can. There is not enough. It's not deep enough to kill me here, so let's just cross like that. It's going to be good enough. And let's see, we should find a few enemies here. It is not a land which is conquested yet. And anyway, I'm just going to ignore them for now, and I will kill them when there are many enough. Let's, oh, these boats look like to be bigger from, from before. It's probably because of the cell. Still, huh? they are nice and all. And are they... Yes, it seems to me they are moving with the waves a bit. Let's take a look with this one. Yes, they are obviously mo moving with the wave. Not a lot, but a bit. Maybe this one is a bit... It's floating a bit too high. I don't know. Anyway, not a big deal. So, <laughs> how do we enter? I'm just going to go around. Maybe I'm not supposed to enter right now. Oh, hello. I'm coming. Be ready. Because I'm going to get you. <laughs> Let's go for the next one, with a big attack. Alright, was a bit less epic. Nonetheless it worked. Oh, oh, I guess you can maybe cross here? If I was to use my my jumping ability to his best, I could just jump over there. And climb a bit, in a way I hope is intended. Yes. So we've been just crossing the camp now, it should be good. And I'm going to climb this area and we are going to try to reach the castle now. Look at that, there is a few guards over there. I have no idea how to enter this place, but there should be a way. But I'm really... You know, there is mostly tents here. We are aiming for the castle. Alright, let's see. Do we have new enemies around? So... I'm not sure the statue where they are. And I've got two ways. I could just climb through the stairs to reach the uh, top of the castle. But I could also check there is a few rooms which could be open. If I'm lucky. We're going to check for these. There was an access somewhere around here. Right, yes, next to the stairs. Or oh, maybe just, you know further the stairs. There was a door over there and I believe it was empty before. Maybe it is still empty but maybe it's not. It's obviously not. What was that? Alright, oh, what is this place? Oh, I think I see something over there. Maybe we're going to find, I don't know, ghost or maybe monster over there. 
And you know what? I'm going to use my lantern here because we're going to be able to see a bit more. Alright. And I really don't need my shield here. Can I protect myself with a lantern? Yes, but... And can I maybe use it as a... Ah, oh, yeah. Okay. Let's go. This is a great addition. I don't know why I'm going down there. It seems to be very dangerous and probably a bad idea. You know what? I'm going to begin with... Ah, we're going to go. If I need to, I will escape. I would not like to die right here. I need to show you so much more stuff. Alright. I believe it's probably time to chicken out. <laughs> Yes, most definitely. I see things over there. We won't be able to cross. Yet. Oh, this is the smoke. Seems to be a very interesting place. Yeah, we're going to go back. I want to choose the top of the castle. It seems to be less dangerous to begin with that. Because these catacombs or crypt seems to be quite dangerous. I will still just take a look in the, um, in the previous room upstairs because I think I saw somebody and I would be able to escape easily. I'm being very cautious because I know some some buses can be very dangerous and they could be a lot, lot more deadly than we expect. So I'm just going to try to be careful here. Okay, I could climb over there. Let's do that. Cl climbing seem, seems somewhat less dangerous. <laughs> What's going on here? Oh, here they are. These are the new enemies we're going to meet and it seems to be pretty dangerous. And they are not so much. Oh, yes they are. Still there, still alive. Maybe not for long. Nah, not for long. And they are dropping their sword, are they? Spectral blade. Yes they are. Okay, so... I did not take so many hits. So I'm going to try to advance a bit. It seems to me there is some kind of beautiful tree over there. So I'm going to try to... How many do we have? Just one? Just one. Here we go. It seems to be quite tough. So I would prefer to avoid being... Killed. Alright. One more down. Do I want to grab this water? Yes, it's a bit better. This little garden is beautiful. Let's see. Do we have more stuff here? This is definitely my kind of castle here. And look at all the light. It's getting pretty through these little areas. Oh! Nice. So we can actually claim through the castle. And we're not obligated to go outside maybe. What do we have here? Oh! Nice. Telescope. And we can see there is a little area with bandits over there next to the little bridge. I don't know if it's still bandits, but we'll see. Oh, I think we should definitely take a look down there. So there is one more of these enemies. And... What are we going to do here? There is a chest here. Can I... Oh, we are being attacked. These guys are tipping. It's interesting. It can, it can be very dangerous. Oh, we've got two swords. So they were trying to hit me with bows. What do we have in there? Uh, we've got a little uh, amulet. Can I use amulet? Yes. And is it bringing me anything? No, not yet. We've got another lantern and a veteran mace. Nah, nothing. Which is going to interest me right now. Still, uh, I can go and try to find more. What is that? Okay, somebody's coming. Where are they? Okay, they're just... Oh, here it is. I 
and nope not good let's go and eat the liver here is there anything happening here nope did i open anything nah we've got another one which is coming and i don't know which one okay you know we are going to go down the the stairs and deal with uh, the one which is just over there. Is it better? It's pretty much the same. I'm pretty sure these enemies are very tough. They've got plenty of life and they are handling pretty well my my attacks. Do we have anything here? Not so much. But it was a very nice setup here. I could definitely see a boss down these stairs. Let's try to explore this area here and see what we've got up there. Oh, look at these. There is even a little chest over there with a maze few things. Okay, the, the, the noise of the chest spooked me a bit. <laughs> I thought I was going to, I don't know, fall in a trap or something. Okay, seems to me we are... are we back? Not so much. Where, can, can, where are you? Is he fleeing? No, not really. But he is doing a pretty nice walk, avoiding my hits. Until now. <laughs> okay, new sword here, which is a bit less interesting. Let's leave these things in there. And check out down there. What do we have? Some other part. You know what? We're going to get out of here and we're going to try to climb the castle. What do we have in there? Oh, I know where we are now. So there is this other one, which seems to be much more powerful than the other one. Let's go and leave this one here. And I've got a new lantern here. Is it is it better? Uh, it seems so. Let's just switch. There we go. I'm going to drop the torch. I don't really need it. It will save me a bit of space. And let's drop this sword as well. Isn't it good? Mm, not so much. Maybe it is. <laughs> I don't know as a matter of fact. Oh, two of these. Let's wait him. He's going to come to me. And... Here he comes. And here it dies. Now let's go for a second one. If there is only two, I should be safe. Oh, he got me. Where is he? Oh! Uh, nope, no good. What else do we have around here? Oh, there is a giant hole here. Oh, this is the place where. The I was looking at. No, this not. This is not. This castle seems to be pretty big. There's even more stuff around here. And uh, now you know what? Let's escape this place. I'm not going to spend the whole video into the darkness. We'll just check this area another time. Let's try to reach the entrance again. And hopefully, I will be able to find my way back, which is not. You know, it's not pretty sure because I'm very bad at sunsetting. I'm lucky that I've been just going through this, uh, not this area, but the previous area many times, so I kind of know a bit how the setup is, is going on. But for this part, I will probably not be able to find my way back. So let's try to do it properly. 
I cannot remember a few setups here, but let's not go too deep in this castle. I think this is kind of my favorite place in the in the castle here. Seems so cool. For now, maybe there is more interesting place. I don't know. Okay, so we are just going to go down there. We are going to exit and I will... Is it the place? Uh, I'm going to go into the main room just for us to check. Okay, there is two more guys. Okay, it seems to be just the same room than upstairs, but... You know, with a few differences as well. Okay, so daylight is coming, it seems. And it's going to be the perfect time to reach the top of the castle. And I believe maybe we are, when we are done with the castle, we could go through the, the beach on this direction here. And um, if I remember right, there is a cave in which we can find some kind of, of giant tree which is going to try to kill us with rocks and stuff. Seems to be a fun way to to finish this, this little walk. So let's just go over there. Plus it's very tough, so... Okay. I kind of hope we're going to find some other kind of enemy here. We add these kind of ghouls into the... of race into the the deep rooms of the castle. What can we find at the top? At least we will get the best view possible here. Oh, this is already new. Can I not go through? Oh, come on. I'm a bit disappointed. I think I need to go through the castle and use... Okay. Uh, yeah, we are going to... Oh, I don't know. I feel like I would like to go into the castle again and and try to reach the top. But at the same time, it's really pretty outside there. And I would definitely like to go a bit further. Okay, I feel like maybe we should go quickly to towards the, the top of the castle. Because maybe if I go all the way to out the beach, which is over there. I will, you know, just find something which is going to be a bit the same, even though we've seen so many things which we're not. And I definitely believe that we'll find different things on the top of the castle. So I'm going to be to begin with a thing with charge, sure. What was that noise? So let's just add for the top. I believe we are not far. I think there is a tower which we almost used, which is around here. And if we were to climb all the way up, maybe with a bit of luck, we would be in the inner sanctuary or something like that. It seems to be pretty high here. Or at least we could just peek in there. Whoa, dangerous. Where are we? Oh. I need more stairs. Oh, hey, you are? I think I saw you earlier, earlier and I just avoid you. Maybe it was a mistake. But we lived a bit more. So, good for you. And. Let's see. What are we? <laughs> I need to know that. Oh, look at that. I think we are... Yes, we are on this bridge. I I think I never crossed this bridge. What do we have done there? So I can see this is yeah, the place I know. On this side. Yeah, alright. Let's go and try to reach the top. We've got another enemy which is going to try to prevent us from going through. And there is some kind of interesting place over there. So who are you? Are you dangerous? Same guy. 
So we'll try to kill you quickly. And here we go. So there is not so much here except the windows. But we can see an interesting part of the castle it seems. And can we no we can climb but we can go down there. And this is our only option, so let's do that. There is quite a lot of interesting setup here. Okay, I love this little round area. Somewhat it's making me think about Dark Soul. It's a very good area to fight and stuff. Even though it's, you know, a lot lighter. And I, I like the fact that the, the game is a lot brighter than other games. So I feel like the the gritty setup seems to be, you know, a bit of a use. And look at this. It's magnificent. Yeah, it's definitely making it. <laughs> Do we have anything hidden behind? It's uh, the water over there. The amount of warp on these things is absolutely amazing. Okay, oh, it was a bit bold. I will not be able to come back. Hopefully we are going to be able to climb this area. I would prefer to at least. <laughs> I don't want to swim in my, in my new armor right now. I need to be careful. I don't want to fall. I've got so many other things to check out around. Oh, we can see the camp from over there. Amazing. And where is our next? So we can go through these little stairs. And what do we have around here? I would kind of like to be able to reach the garden which was at the top. Because I really want to see how it has evolved. We could just remove the, the lantern, I don't want to... Uh, I think I was using this shield. I don't really remember everything, so... Because uh, maybe the, the lantern is changing a bit the, the way this area is, is supposed to be perceived. Alright, so this is the exit. If I was to fall in the water and survive, I could just reach uh, the land from here. And oh, look at that! I think I'm going to manage to climb this. I realize this is little stairs and stuff. I just feel like you know a bit, like we are a knight of the sanctuary and we are going to go for a fight over there. Seems cool. Okay, here we climb. Just a bit more dangerous. Uh, and I felt. Oh, yes, yes, we are going there. Quite a view here. Let's try not to fall. Can I just maybe take a peek here? Yeah, but dang too dangerous. Let's stick to. What do I have here? I could. Nah, I'm not going to go down there. I'm just going to aim for the. for the men area here. 
Okay, it's a bit more epic how we are climbing through this area. It was just a lot easier before. So we are. Just, it's just worth more now. <laughs> Got much more. I like this place. I'm going to try to check if I can, you know, unlock the door. Just to see. Maybe I can. Look at this ray of light and, and these things being just beautifully lit and stuff. Alright, there is even more place to, to discover. Yeah, amazing. Good. Okay, so... I think first we're going to visit a bit the uh, exterior here and we'll take a look at the indoor rooms a bit later. Let's just check. There is a few interesting areas to, to see. We are coming from here and there is an area which was closed over there. So I'm just going to take a look here in this little area which seems to be pretty interesting. With little, yes, there is a bit of water and stuff. It's beautiful. Look at that. And uh, there is even more spot with water around. This is something which was. It's a very good, very good addition. We were lacking a bit of water here. And we've got the nice statue which is still there with a beautiful view, I think. Yes, but very dangerous, so we're just going to keep it for another time. Oh, there is definitely an area I can access here. And let's see if there is anything up these stairs. There was only a, a closed door before, but maybe now. As the castle, yes, it's open. Let's see what we've got in there. It's kind of the highest spot of the castle. And. Where is the knight which was. Oh, it's just out there. Ah, come on, come back. I just got a few more it for you and I will be good. So, where are we? Okay, I feel like we're going to maybe join the other entrance. Okay, a few more of these. Let's check. And I should have avoided that. <laughs> Just a little roll on stuff, but these guys are just going to... Oh, what do we have here? Nope, 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 nope. Not for me. Okay, what do we have over there? More knights. Race. These are not nice. Knights. I love the way they die. What do we have there? Is there some kind of boss or something? Nope. Maybe it was. <laughs> I don't know. And this... Oh, this area it seems to be lit. It's strange. Where are we? Oh, here we are. This is the uh, exit. And I'm going to take this opportunity to just go back and go a bit further on the... on the next area. Just so to see if there is anything new. Because we are going to reach one hour of gameplay and I prefer not to go too much further. So let's just hurry up and reach the next area. I need to cross this little gap between the, the bridge, uh, not the bridge, the walls, my mistake. 
under the bridge. <laughs> And then we'll... I don't know if we can actually just ult kind of ulster the, <laughs> the sword and shield, it would be cool. I'm always... You know, I, I like to not run around with my weapon on, it seems to be a bit odd. It's true that there is danger everywhere here, so maybe it's a good thing, but... Nonetheless... Okay, so let's see. For now, this part is similar. And... Uh, oh, so I think the roof maybe is a bit different. But I feel like we're going to find pretty much the same kind of enemies here. This was, after all, some kind of bandit quarter. And they were pretty tough last time I've been coming here. What's going on? Are they fighting together? No. These are not fighters, these are uh, little spot to dry the fish. Yes. Hello. Anybody there? Nope. There is no more bandit here. There was a bandit over there. So I've left. You can stall the fish. And nobody in there either. Nah. Oh. What is that? We've got a bit of equipment here. Lantern and stuff. Interesting. Let's keep going and access the cave. We should just go back on the road and we should just be able to go far enough to reach the caves. Where were these things? It was guarded by a Valerian soldier the last time I've been coming here. Maybe it's going to be a bit different. Maybe it's not, we'll see. Okay, so it seems to me... Yes, Valerian soldiers, they are still there. They're going to try to prevent me to fight the, the giant tree. Fortunately for them, I um, decided to go there. And what was this sword here? Legging. Let's take a look. No, nope, wrong guard. Maybe this one. Yes. So is it better than mine? Uh, oh, maybe. Restoring stamina. No, my, mine are restoring life. It's useful. <laughs> kind of. So I'm just going to leave this thing behind. And we're going to fight the tree. Or die trying. I should manage to, to deal with him though. This is not my first run here. But he's, he's really huge. It's always impressive to go and see him. If he's still there, who knows. Maybe I could find something else. Yeah, I think he's still there. And he's still angry at me because I see his life. He's going to send me rocks like these. Oh, I took quite a hit here. So maybe I'm going to die here. Oh, very likely. I'm going to try to hit me. Come on. Let's just go and... Here he is. Let's just go and attack him quite strongly. There's a moss. Nah. Let's just go and try to drink a potion here. Oh. Not good. Not quick. But I can attack him again and try to... I don't need so much more hits. Alright, can I use some kind of healing here? Ouch! Must get killed. Not part. Okay, where is he? He's going to get me killed. Okay. I need to finish quickly. Oh, come on. He's going to finish me. No, he's down. Okay, good. And I've got a new sword here, which seems to be pretty good. So, it is going to be, you know, a bit stuck here. Oh, what, what is that? I've never seen this. There is some access over there. So, if I was, you know, going there, I could maybe 
grab something interesting. But there is no way for me to climb here, is it? Possible or not? Not so much. Let's just take a look at this wall. Okay, so the new sword is this one, the Agristal Bleed, with um, 54. Oh, it's even better. Uh, 100 sword. Let's just go, go for it. So I'm even more dangerous here. Yeah. Okay, we're just going to go out and see a bit of light. Because it's, these, ca these caves are nice, but the beauty is outside. I should drink something, because I'm almo almost dead. Alright, so guys, I'm going to conclude this video here. I hope you like it. If you do, please leave a like, a comment, or subscribe. And I'll see you next time, guys. Have fun!